Hello and welcome back to Castlevania Lords of Shadows. In the first episode we made some introductions basically with the main character and we played the first few levels of the first three levels to be exact of the first chapter and I've been thinking about it maybe I will backtrack a little bit uh, off camera and if I struggle with things I probably do that backtrack and um, start going through the level again and collecting magic gems um, but for now we'll we'll keep going so let's go to Pan's temple the stench of the bog fades into memory and a land of great beauty lies before him a paradise where nature lives in harmony with all living creatures Indeed, a refuge for those who wish it. He is close now, close to the old gods and the old ways. Long forgotten by men, this kingdom was once revered by all. Yet now only a small part remains. Soon even this will disappear. The amulet senses its master. Its journey is almost over. He will need all his strength now, all his wits. If he is to succeed here, if he is to convince the old god to help him. Oh, what's that? The magical amulet glows with an arcane magic. What is its purpose? So what is this? A magic rune is revealed in the amulet. Can you... Perhaps you can light them all. Okay, so we need to find these... These stones apparently to find the right path probably okay there's another one and I think I need to lower the music a little bit again unfortunately it gets a little bit too it's still too loud Unfortunately. So I have to go back to the one I had actually set previously. Okay, we've got another knight's corpse with a scroll on him. Let's see. <coughs> the ravaged corpses of my brothers lie scattered everywhere. I feel guilty looting the bodies of my comrades, but I must find more life gems or I am lost too. Forgive me, my brothers. I won't last long unless I increase my chances of survival and the dead have no use for th such things anymore. I know that there is a life gem nearby, I can sense it, but I just need to rest for a moment, feel so weak. So we do get a hint at a life gem here. Apparently, there's supposed to be one around somewhere. The question is, can I find it? Or is it just up ahead somewhere? I don't know. We'll, we'll see. So, did I miss something? Uh -huh. There's another corpse. Let's go back and take another look. I think I missed something back there. Maybe I can use the chain to get up somewhere. Is that it? Okay, or is it somewhere off to the side? Mayhaps? Or a little bit back. I don't know. We, we we can't see anything. So let's keep going again. And maybe the life gem is actually uh, on that knight we saw there. Might be what's going on there. Because there was one right up there. Okay, we can't go that way. 
Let's see. Is that a life gem? Nope, it's another scroll. My darling Martha, I fear that I am not going to make it back. Look after yourself and our beloved daughter. God forgive me for fa failing in my task. Know that you will always be in my heart and that one day we will be together again. Your loving husband, Victor. Oh, damn. So... Yep. Okay, we've, we have three. Oh, there's a chest. You cannot reach this Brotherhood arc. Come back later once your skills have improved. Okay. There's another stone. So we're at four now. And we're just missing the one in the middle. Um. Okay, there it is. It's right ahead. And apparently we... I don't know where that life gem is supposed to be. Oh, okay. What? Um, we don't have... What? Oh, so change room. That's what it is. Okay. So we want this one. Uh, it's just, I'm assuming that up down is left right in this case. Correct at the moment, so we need this. Nope, one more, and here we need the. There it is. Okay, so that was not too bad. I don't know why that small elf was needed there, but okay. <laughs> but this looks pretty, pretty cool. That's some big trees. <clears throat> Let's keep going. And I really don't know where we might have missed that health globe. Looked like it. It we got everything there. I didn't see a path at least. Show yourself. The Brotherhood needs your help. I need your help. I know who you are, Gabriel. I am the guardian of the Lake of Oblivion, where the living can communicate with the dead. Tell me, warrior, are you aware of what is happening in the world? We have been deserted by God. Creatures from the void come to claim the souls of men, to wipe mankind from the face of the earth. And what of the elders of your order? What do they think? That God has not abandoned us. They believe that a powerful spell has been unleashed by someone or something. A spell that has isolated our world from the heavens, cutting us off from God and allowing evil to flourish unchecked. Why have the Brotherhood of Light sent you to the Lake of Oblivion? They have dreamt that a message waits for me at this lake. A message that holds a clue to our salvation. I was instructed to seek you out, in the hope that you may show me the path. The Elders believe that these dreams are the last message from the heavens, and that you should know something that we are unaware of. Is that it? Yes. My wife... Marie was murdered not two days ago by the evil that roams these lands. Her soul and those of the recently departed are trapped here and cannot find peace. And that is why they sent you to the Lake of Oblivion, because they believe that she is waiting for you here. 
to deliver a message to you. Yes. Will you help me? Only the most deserving of the living are worthy of speaking to the dead. Are you worthy, Gabriel? That's a guillotine. Oh, what select ring? Oh no, I. Oh god, of course it's a puzzle. So do. How does this clockwise? Okay, that didn't really work. So I, I hate these kinds of puzzles. But it actually should work out. So I got lucky there. Let's do it one more time. Okay, yeah, that was pretty lucky. <laughs> I did not really see the pattern in time. But um okay what just happened What was that What does this mean Tell me only that you have passed the test you appear worthy of entering the Lake of Oblivion. Okay, so we didn't actually go there yet. Make sure you have your daggers with you. One never knows when need may arise. That's one foreboding sentence. Okay, that was it already. That was quick. So yeah, we missed one. We missed one gem. The only one we could have gotten there. And let's buy some skills maybe. I don't think so yet. We should save up for these. Or do I want the downward punch? Didn't I buy that already? Oh, no, I can knock them down now, basically after the air grab. Yeah, why not? That sounds useful. So this is basically if I, I keep pressing it or press it again, I assume. We'll see. So now we're at Oblivion Lake. The test has shaken him. I see the doubt in his eyes as he heads towards the lake. So Pan is helping him now. That's good. Perhaps it bodes well. I wonder if he knows what awaits him here, in this place where the dead can contact the living. It is cold now. A chill wind blows through his heart. I can see it. Feel it. He will need help if he is to succeed. He must not fail. He will not fail, 
Not now. Not yet. Not if I have anything to do with it. Oh, that became icy real quick here. Oh, wow. That's, that's really drastic climate change from swamp to ice to, I don't know. Oh, but I think I remember this. Oh, we found a life gem. Nice. So we got two now. And I think I remember this. And this will get difficult, I think. I think this is the first boss fight. And it's a big one. Literally. <laughs> yeah, you should better run, I think. Gabriel. Might not hurt. Yeah, that's a hand. And is that ice or solid ground we're standing on? Looks like solid, solid ground. You still got something on your face there, buddy. You might want to try and take that off. Holy crap. Yeah, that thing is a little bit bigger. So I assume we have to walk towards it. Ouch. So I think, uh, how can I just attack him? Doesn't really look like it. Uh, I think I remember it somewhat though, maybe? Yep, there it is. Ah, uh, come on. I'll find a way to climb up. There it is. Okay, yeah. Search and destroy the runes that animate the Titan. Okay. Yep, I still need to keep my grip. I can't really move though. Okay, yeah, now I can. Oh. Yeah, he's he's pulling back out. Okay, I screwed that up, so we need to do that again. I, I held RT. I don't know why that fails. Oh, I'm already liking this section a lot. Come on. And this time I jumped and did not take damage. Oh, I pressed it again, but apparently too late. And we're, we're taking a lot of dumb damage. Because every time we fall off, we get hurt. Okay, this time he didn't get stuck, apparently. Ow. Yeah, he hit us there. Okay, so I needed to just keep it longer. So where do I need to go up? Actually, I made almost around now. 
Can I go up somewhere? Probably in that middle section, I assume. Yep, okay, that's it. Okay, we're we're making progress right now. That's good. Up, please. More up. I won't be thrown off anymore. Oh boy. Not far enough. Still need to hold on. Oh, there's a room. We see it. I need to hold on. He will throw me off otherwise. Okay, come on. We can get it. Oh. Good thing he didn't throw me off again. Come on. Finally. Thank you. Oh, hello. Okay, so far so good. I'm still holding. Let's keep moving here. Oh yeah, this is two hits, three hits. Keep holding. Oh, I need to get away. Oh, he hit me. Oh, please tell me I don't have to do that all again. Yep, I'm dead. Let's restart from the last checkpoint. Oh yeah, we need to start right again. So that's not nice. And how do I dodge that attack? At least this time I did dodge that one. Come on, hit me. I really don't know what I need to do there. Oh, no. Ah, he got me. Please let me out. Jumping sometimes doesn't really work, and... But apparently this time it did, but he's not using the tank that will allow me to deal any damage to him. Which, now he is, finally. Thank you. So, get up there. And I hope I will not screw up again. Oh, come on. This way. Up. Okay. I'm holding on. And I just didn't really know how to avoid that one attack of his when we were on his chest. I hope there is a way to avoid it. But we'll see. For now, we'll have to focus on this one. Let's wait for him to shake us first. Oh, come on. And let's hold on. Oh, yep. Okay, worked. And in theory, I like these kinds of bosses. But if you just have to start over from the beginning again, it can get a little bit frustrating. Uh, which is basically what's happening right now. Let's see if we can do this again. Yep. No. And hopefully this time we can do a little bit better. Oh, come on. That positioning was a little bit finicky. And I can't attack from there, so I need to be there, actually. I just thought I could get right on it, but apparently I can't. Okay, we need to get away. Okay, I can l jump left. That... That helps. I did not know that. So let's try to get this one done. Oh no, I, I got too greedy there. So does the pattern change or do I need to start? Oh, wow. Yeah, I need to start from the beginning again. That's not too good. Oh no, he at least we get that. 
Okay, let's go here and then, oh, he hit somewhere else this time, of course. And we'll keep taking damage, which is pretty bad. Okay, so we probably need to go here and... Yeah, he... I keep making the same mistake, which is not good. Okay, that was better. So let's keep standing now and dodge this way. Okay. Nope, you won't throw me off this time. We're almost dead, but I want to get that second gem. Or rune. Please tell me. Oh, I did not tell you to go left. Okay, perfect. And that's a checkpoint, so at least we will we will move on there. Oh, we're on his back now. I hope he can't reach me here. But for some reason, I assume he will be able to. Oh, I don't want to be thrown off anymore. If I can avoid it. Oh, there's... Okay, yeah, I needed to jump left again there. But this time it should be fine, I think. Nope, yeah. I mean, he's, he did lose health there. So maybe... We just need to get closer and we'll start it off again. With the right section? I don't know. We'll, we'll see. At least they're giving us enough time to to do something here. Dodge. And let's do this. Is that thing destroyed there? Yes, okay, yeah, we're just destroying it right away. So that's what's happening now. That works for me. And let's keep going. So I need to move left once he grabs over. Yep, that works. Okay, perfect. One, two, three, and he's grabbing us again, please. Oh, that was close. Oh, nice. Really nice. There's one more, I think. to go from here. Probably... Oh, yeah. I. Th oh, we got thrown off. I'm stupid. Oh, I might die now. Oh, yeah. Thank you. He gives us the right attack right away. So we might have a chance here. Maybe. I assume he will try to hit us again. And we just work our way through this. I think I need to go down and right. Basically the, the area that opened up. I, I did not realize that in the beginning. But I need to make sure that I'm not being thrown off here. And he's doing that a lot right now. Not too surprising, but still. Okay, come on. One more. Oh, I can do it all here from here already. But where do I need to go? Up? Alright. Oh, I fell off again. Yeah, that's not good. Oh, one more hit and I'm done. That's nice. <laughs> so I assume I will have to do this part again. And you get to see that again. But that's what you sign up for. But so far, so good. We might... I do get another chance here, I hope. Because this is basically just um, going through the ropes right now. And there's the next point. 
I just don't know yet where I need to go, really, once I'm on the back of his head. I hope I can see that now, because he's just shaking his head a lot, and that makes progressing really hard. More and up. Now keep holding on. So I assume I need to go right, but we can't really move a lot. Okay, but that's exactly where I need to go. And I assume we need to... Oh, what? He's just moving his head so much. He will try to hit us again, I assume. Yep, we need to dodge. Okay, that's good enough. And please let me not screw up again. It would be the death of us. One, two, three. Oh, hang on. Dodge. We should be really close right now. There it is. Oh, we just needed one more. Oh, ow. What the hell? Oh, hello. Who's that? Uh, well, I know who it is. It's the narrator. Also known as Patrick Stewart, but it's his character. <laughs> Give me your dagger, quickly! Okay. Take down. <laughs> And I assume this would be a little bit better with, with higher music, but I still don't know if I can do that. Maybe we'll turn try to turn it up a little bit again. Yeah, just accept that you, you're down, please. But from the looks of things, this guy is from the same order as we are. Marie! So did that guy pass the test as well then? Maybe? Forgive me. I was not there to save you. There is nothing to forgive, my love. I am so happy to look upon your face again. And I yours. My love, the elders of the Order hope that you can help us to understand what is happening. The world has been isolated from the heavens. Some believe that God has abandoned us. Can it be true? I feel that... that the spirits are trying to talk to me. They whisper things to me. It is hard to understand them all. It, it is so dark. So many people crying. I cannot find them in the blackness. I'm scared. There is something else. A shadow is on my mind. You must help us, Gabriel. What are they telling you? Who are they? They are the spirits who founded your order. And that the power of the Lords of Shadow is the key. They talk of a prophecy. I don't understand what they mean. I can feel myself fading. I can hardly see you. Darkness is closing oh. around me. Marie. I love you, Gabriel. Don't go, Marie. I love you too. Oh, he's got a sword. Why are you here? Who sent you? I am Zobek, a warrior of your brotherhood. Pan and I are old acquaintances. He felt you would be in need of my assistance. I have heard of you. I am sorry. My name is Belmont. I know who you are. 
Was that the spirit of someone you know? Yes. It was my wife. Forgive me. I couldn't help but overhear what she told you. It sounds like the spirits who founded our order are trying to tell us something very important through her. What do you mean? Only that the founders of the order seem to be using the dead to communicate with us. The prophecy has been secret for many centuries. It is known only to a select few. There is no way she could have known of it unless they managed to tell her somehow. Praise be to God. What prophecy? It is written that a pure-hearted warrior will claim the power of the Lords of Shadow as his own and use it in order to overcome all evil. It is said this warrior would become God's vassal on Earth, supremely powerful, who could do anything. The Founding Spirits have not abandoned us, Gabriel. Thanks to your Marie, we now know there is some hope. We have to enter the lands of the Dark Lords, you and I. We must reclaim the powers they hold and unite the heavens with this world once more. And don't you see, Gabriel? You can bring her back. If what you say is true, then we need to work quickly and in secret. The Lords of Shadow must not suspect we are on their trail, and they will turn all of their attention towards us. We should take different routes, you and I. I will head for the land of the Lycans. You leave for the territory of the Vampires and prepare the way. Then we must go on to the Lord of the Necromancers together. His realm lies furthest. Our enemy must suspect nothing. Take this. It will allow you to absorb spiritual energy, and will help cure your wounds. Good luck, my friend. May we be granted victory. Thank you, brother. You have given me renewed hope. Did he tell all the truth, though? That's the question. Because he seemed to be observing us before we... He helped us for a little bit longer. So I don't... I really don't know yet. We'll have to wait and see for that. But this is the end of Chapter 1. We get more skills. We get a Light Gem Medallion. Um, we maybe can see what that does. So let's see what we get here, or what we could buy. We could go for the area Counter-Strike, I don't think so. A direct heavy combo. So we hold the X key on the first attack, and that way we do a slower but, but stronger attack. Or the circular chain, which is X, Y, and Y. A combination attack useful in many different battle situations. It begins with a direct attack, closely followed by two area attacks. Use this attack to attack an America while keeping others at bay. That sounds really good, actually. So I think we're going to go with that one for now. Uh, yep. Let's get it. And then we can continue. So this is the end of chapter one. And I will end this episode here for today. We're, we're at almost at 40 minutes again. Uh, because I, I died, it took a little bit longer. <laughs> so I think what I will do is this. Yes. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed this second episode of Castlevania Lords of Shadow. We finally learn a bit, a little bit more about the story and our purpose in this whole endeavor. And I am curious to see where this will take us. We're going to go f for the Lycanthropes next, apparently. So more werewolves and wargs and whatever they're called in the upcoming near future. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did please leave a like and a comment. 
And if you want to see me play more Castlevania or other games, just subscribe if you haven't already. You can also follow me on Twitter at Tharik Rekov, and I would really appreciate that. So, as always, thanks for watching. I hope that you tune in next time, and have a nice day. Bye.